All right, I just rebuilt my whole set turbo. And very little shaft play, but uh, the problem I constantly have with this whole set, on my Z anyway, the, uh, the rear seal goes out. I've had it happen two or three times. Well, at least three, because I, I know how to rebuild this very easily now. So now we got new bearings, new everything inside, you know, the bearing kit. Uh, for the RB, I am going to, I had ported this wastegate out right here for the, uh, for the Z. Well, anyway, I'm going to just tack weld that closed because I have a external wastegate. So anyway, boy, she's got very little shaft play. Nice. Uh, not going to put it together till I get it on the car and know how it all needs to be clocked. But uh, that's what's uh, going to go on there. And this baby sucker whistles so nice when it's spooling up. That's the one thing I miss about the GT35R or having the GT35R is I miss that awesome whistle upon spool up. So. All right, I put the whole set HY35 turbo on. Oh, it was not fun. Had to make a down pipe and intercooler piping changed a little bit. No big deal. But I, I got a problem. The header, and I knew I had this problem, but I, I kept putting it on there. The header is up too high, and that hood. It's pretty good. I um, cut out the support where the turbo is, but it's still hitting right there. So that kind of sucks. Anyway, this is the ah, uh, this is the very first start after putting that on. Pre-oiled the turbo, of course. Now, as it warms up, it's probably gonna smoke really good, but I'll let the turbo get some oil. And let the car warm up a little bit, and then we'll take it for a drive. Let me show you the hood. I don't know, man. I'm, I might notch it. I don't know. Not good. I've been working on it so much. Uh, I may take the hood back off and just drive it like that for a little bit. I don't know. Notch it and put one of those gay little scoop things. I don't know. All right, I'm going to let it warm up. All right. I'm watching the wide band again. And the revs, the turbo comes on later in the revs. Again, I'm, I'm taking it easy because I'm, I'm watching my AFRs. Seems like we're getting boost. What was that? In the fours, I think? 4,000 range? So you can tell right there it's changed dramatically. The other turbo, being so small, was coming on before 3,000. Now you got it coming on earlier than that. And it feels feels really good. This is 12 pounds, you know. Wow. Man, that, that feels good. 
feels good. Feels really good. Move the power band. Man, the AFRs look great. You know, up until even though it's hitting boost later, uh, it, it all it all looks good. So uh, so far, I'm pretty happy. Besides the fact that the the hood won't close. And man, I don't know. What do you do about that? Just not gonna worry about it right now. Let me turn around because. Dude on a motorcycle messed up my turnaround. Okay, turned around. Still 12 pounds. And spin in second. Wow, golly, man. That's a different animal. That is 12 pounds of boost. I can't believe it, man. I'm not even really staying in it very long. Notice that blow-off valve sound is different. Well, uh, the other one, I was getting lots and lots of, uh, uh, blah, 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 blah. what do you call it? Uh, it's coming back out of the housing. Um, compressor surge. So it, it kind of made it sound cool because it would, you know, pew, have a higher pitch and then pew, the blow-off sound. So uh, I know it sounded good, but it was it was not right. I'm getting no compressor surge now. It's just uh, plain old the good stuff. Let's uh, I'm gonna turn turn my boost controller on. Now this is 14 pounds of boost, but I gotta watch this big old dip right here around this corner. I gotta tell you, man, I hit this last time in a video. Oh, yeah. All right, so this is 16. I gotta watch AFRs here. Yep, yep, yep. Did I say 16? Uh, that's 14-ish pounds. Anyway, you know, I'm running, I don't even know what kind of fuel pump, uh, stock injectors, so we are going to turn that boost controller right back off. It has uh, changed the uh, changed the power band. So there you go. There's a whole set turbo for you. Spin in second. Pulls really nice. That's it. <laughs>